Hello and welcome friends. I am your teacher Anki. Today I am going to start a new topic for search engines in digital marketing to see the web pages in the digital marketing season 2. So don't forget to subscribe the channel and hit the like button. Let's get started. Hey friends, welcome back. As you all know, making your web pages search friendly is our topic for today as you all seen in the headlines and in the thumbnails. So in this video, we will talk about the simple things you can do to optimize the web pages of your website so search engines can find you more easily because if they can so can potential customers. Let's hear it from Adrian about the impact this had on the, his business. He said, all speech is great and small. Somebody gave me a very very basic tip when I first started out. He just said make every page as good as it's possible as can be. So, if you are writing about something, have as much information on it as you can. Customers believed in my site because they could see that I believed in what I was talking about and the more I added the more they came, the more conversions I made. When I first started out, I just had a page best man speech which literally said best man speech is great if you want a best man speech written contact me and once I added more to it about how to deliver these things what to look out what not to do what to avoid who to mention then lots more people clicked on the contact button on page optimization or changes you can make to your website's individual pages can quickly help. Search engines better understand your content. Let's say you run a small form called Blake's produce and are looking to optimize a page about your fresh fruits and vegetable selection. There are several elements on your page that can tell the search engine that the page is all about what to about it, fresh fruit and vegetables. These includes meta tags and title, headings and the page copy itself. Let's start with the meta tags and title. These are not something you would see on a web pages unless you are looking at the code. They are embedded messages that help the search engine determine what's on the page. In particular, there is the title and the meta descriptions which is going on. The title and the meta description are important because they are both used by the search engine to generate the actual search results for this specific page. The title is used to generate the first line shown. The meta description is used to generate the few short sentences that follow. For a page about fruits and vegetables, you will want to make sure that the phrase fruits and vegetables is in both the title and the meta description of that video or the content. A good title would be Blake's produce fresh fruit and vegetables. This describes what the page is about and also highlights your company name. A good meta description is usually two short sentences. It should also reinforce the title by using the keyword or phrase again. A good description would be Blake's produce delivers organic fresh fruits and veg to your home. So often, as often as you need it order your customized box online for everybody. A title should be short or sweet. A description should match what the page is all about. You should also consider what's on the page itself. What people, who people you visit site. Not just the search engines actually see, there are two things you can optimize here to help search engines categorize your content correctly, headings and page copy. 
like meta tags headings are embedded in the html code of your page but they are also visible to the people in any case often they are displayed at the top of the page a great heading would be fresh fruits and vegetables which clearly tells a person what the page is about but also works well for the search engines too finally if you are writing a piece of content about fresh fruits and vegetables you will naturally want to use that phrase in the copy but don't go overboard and repeat the phrase over and over because search engines may see that as spam as much as you see remember that you are writing primarily for people so be sure your message is clear and straight so let's recap what you have done to optimize the farms web pages you have looked at each of the major elements used by search engines and each instance told them this page is about fresh fruits and vegetables no matter where search engine look they will see consistent and clear information about what's on the page and that might help improve your search engine rankings i think you should learn this i hope you like the video and hit the like button of this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel thank you very much have a good day